my dear people of Ondo State. It was the first public speech of Governor Loki Aedachiwa in the new year. The governor, who said the events of the past year will help the state to be more united, said all hands must be on deck to ensure that the new year brings prosperity to the state and its people. Governor Aedachiwa, who described the demise of his former boss as unfortunate, stressed the need for all to work together to fulfill his dreams for a better Ondo state. We will not only give our late former governor a befitting state barrier, but we will also immortalize his name, just as we will strive to complete all the developmental projects he embarked upon as governor of Ondo State. His death was preceded by events that tested us in diverse ways, but those challenges have shaped our resolve to, more than ever before, bring our people together and pursue the attainment of a peaceful and prosperous Kondo state. It is time to put the past behind us and focus all our human and material resources into building on the foundation that this administration has so far laid. Governor Aida Tiwa said the 2024 budget, Christine's budget of economic resilience, will promote overall development and welfare of the people of the state. The budget, which we christened budget of economic resilience, will instigate development while we critically prioritize the present needs of, our, of the people and create the conditions for a desirable future with prudent use of our collective resources. This budget underscores our determination to put workers' welfare as top priority. We will also focus on human capital development, environmental sustainability, rural development, and completing ongoing infrastructural projects in our states. Aida Tiwa, who noted the importance of the new year to the political climate of the state, appealed to political players and residents to eschew violence as the state hosts the governorship election. Let me implore all political parties, aspirants, and their followers to eschew violent conduct that can threaten the peace and tranquility of our state and ensure that they follow strictly the guidelines issued by the electoral umpire. The election should be a contest of ideas and choices and not an opportunity to settle political scores or an excuse for calumny. The governor expressed appreciation to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu and leaders of the ruling All Progressives Congress, APC, at both the national and state levels for their support for the state. I wish to also use this occasion to affirm my commitment to the people of Ondo State. I am persuaded that he who has brought us this far will faithfully help us throughout this new year. I am more optimistic about our future than I've ever been. I therefore call on you all to intensify prayers for the peace and prosperity of our dear states. He also thanked workers in the state, royal fathers, religious leaders, security agencies, and the media for standing by the present administration. Wahab Bankoli, OSRCNs.